The world we live in is extremely complex, way more so than we are taught in school, where things are simplified and often misleading. An example, many young people are told that atoms are the smallest particles in the world, with no mention of subatomic particles. The subatomic world is a confusing and chaotic place where the laws of physics we know today do not apply. This week on Future 5, we talk about some of the strangest and most useful properties and discoveries in quantum mechanics. Number 1. Possibility Space Many theories attempt to explain the oddities that exist on a quantum level by using alternate realities and things such as the string theory to try and connect relativity and quantum mechanics. Nothing has been proven so far and it's been impossible to implement the two theories under the same laws and mathematics. Our best efforts to explain what we see have been to describe the particles that exist on a subatomic level as both a wave and a solid piece of matter. Particles that exist under these physics are not subject to the laws of physics we know. These particles are capable of being not just in one place but all places at the same time. Sounds impossible, right? Well, this is why it's such a problem for scientists. These kind of particles can spread themselves over an infinite area and appear to be in any place at any given time. But, at the same time, these particles act as if they are solid and can be observed in a location to be stagnant. The weird properties in these particles are already being used for quantum teleportation as well as quantum computing. Number 2. Antiparticles in quantum mechanics, things do what they want, and not what makes sense. Some particles only pop into existence for fractions of a second, before annihilating themselves with their counterparticle. These virtual particles have the same properties as their real counterparts, however they are reversed. We still don't know why antiparticles exist, or why there isn't an equal amount of antimatter as there is matter in the universe. But since the discovery of the positron, we've had the ability to create things such as PET scans and MRIs to utilize its properties. Number 3. Quantum Tunneling We've already talked a bit about quantum tunneling, but its properties are utilized in way more technology than people are aware of. Quantum tunneling is a phenomenon where a particle is capable of tunneling through a barrier. This phenomenon plays a role in many advanced technologies as well as many advanced natural phenomena such as the fusion in the sun. Applications for quantum tunneling are still being discovered, but currently we've had great success in creating tunnel diodes, quantum computers and scanning tunneling microscopes, which are very important in modern physics. Number 4. Qubits Quantum computing has been a dream that still seems just out of reach. Modern quantum computers are very sensitive and need extreme conditions in order to operate correctly. Often, these computers need to be cooled to near absolute zero to stay stable and that's only the tip of the iceberg in getting them to be practical. The other big fallback that's been holding back quantum computers from becoming consumer based is how to program them properly. Instead of traditional bits, quantum computers use qubits, a two-state quantum mechanical system. Instead of the classical one or zero that normal bits use, these qubits utilize one zero and everything in between them all at once. Australian engineers have recently built the first quantum logic gate in silicon for performing quantum computations. This is a huge step forward in what is needed to make programming these machines possible. Number 5. What is nothing? What if there's no such thing as nothing? One would think by definition the properties of empty space would be just that, empty. But recently, scientists have been studying the deep vacuums of space scanning for possible fluctuations or glimpses of quantum phenomena. Now a team of scientists at the University of Constance have succeeded in directly accessing the characteristics of the ground state of empty space. These so-called vacuum fluctuations were detected by using short light pulses while employing a highly precise optical measurement technique. According to the model of quantum mechanics, these fluctuations were told to exist even in total empty space. The success of these findings are of fundamental importance for the further development of quantum physics. And that concludes our episode on discoveries in quantum mechanics. A real brain twister, isn't it? 
Well, welcome to Quantum Mechanics. For more Future 5, subscribe for new episodes every Wednesday. You can also follow us on Facebook and Twitter, links in the description. Thanks for watching.